Hey man, say man, shout out to ETV man from HMT to the ETV man. Y'all know what the fuck going on, man. Why me and that man checking in? Hey, sometimes I get on my knees and ask the Lord, oh, why so deep in these streets? Got me clutching on glocks and things, if and ends in two, two, three. Stay down with my goddamn team. Look at us now, buying chains and flashy things. Hey, whoa, yeah, yeah. Why me and Jaja, what's good? What's up with my boy Easy? Hey man, you done pulled up in Dallas on the kid, you know, we were rocking with Easy TV. You my uh my second interview for the year. We only what two, three days in? Two, three days in. I feel like ready, uh, man. Yeah, for sure. I feel like this interview is much needed. Boys making so much noise around the ace right now, you know what I'm saying? Here I'm Clark's own YB and Jaja. You uh you got any you got any introduction, words you wanna say before we get to it? Shit. Really just speak for myself right now. They know why me and Dada so true to the street, man. Yeah, for sure. What you smoking on, man? You know that exotic right here, man. Nothing much, nothing much. Ain't nothing me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I see boys getting a little money, too. You got the BB Civics belt on and with the wool. Yeah, you know. <laughs> this is some clock boy drip and shit, man. Yeah, you know? for sure, for sure. Um, shit, let's get straight into it, man. As I said, he, you, you from the clock, but like, let the people know where you from, man. Shit, south side of Houston. You know, other side of 16. Right there, Herman Club Road, South Post, Stoke Alameda, you know, right there by the mall, not too far from the mall. Pearland, ain't too far, you know, Sunnyside, you know, all that shit, but you know, Herman Club, 3800 Native, out the sheds. For sure, for sure. Um, shit, let's get straight to the next question. Um, they, they, you ain't had much more to elaborate on that one, did you? Just gonna keep it's it like that, for it's sure. Yeah, the people know what's up. <laughs> um, how was uh, things growing up for you in your neighborhood? Shit, I can say rough, most part, you yeah. know, single mom, projects, you know, she working hard, busting ass, putting food on the table, roof over here, you know, she liked it. For sure, for sure. Um, so, like, uh, did you, you know, in, in any form, of shape, or fashion, like, attempt any way to try to help out, or you just, she, she kept you on the straight and narrow? Shit. Growing up, you know, then motherfuckers you hang around the floor and she said, peer pressure motherfucker, you know, nigga hop off the porch. Yeah, for sure. Doing this own thing, you yeah. Know? Now, see, you still young, bruh. You know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> 21, I, I get 21. Yeah, okay, I feel that. I feel that. Young nigga getting to it. Um, shit, man, let's get straight into it. Uh, so the name, YB and Jaja. Now, before you answer that, I know you got uh, Almighty J, um, uh, what's his name? What's the other dude's name? Uh, Namir. Namir. Yeah, yeah. Now, so I, I, I know Shout it's to the. You know, yeah, yeah. Do you know them at all? Any by any chance? Nah, I just fuck with them music. Oh, okay. What what show? Uh, YBN stand for? And yeah, how long has it been the float? Shit, it's been the float for probably about I say about about three about three years now, four years. You know, young brick nigga. If you don't know. YBN shit, current clock shit, YMG, Young Mark Realization shit, you know, it's all up, it's all up, Southside, you know, Southside. <laughs> for sure, for sure. Um, so where, where'd you come up with the name from? You just, where, where, where does Jaja originate from? Jaja really come from shit, my grandma used to call me Jaja. Oh, so my yeah, that, that ain't a hood name, that's a, you shit. know, grandma gave that nickname, it's Stick. Yeah, he just Stick. People fuck with him, and, you know, bitches for sure gonna say it. Ain't gonna wear them motherfucker hat. <laughs> <laughs> you funny, dog. <laughs> um, I'm glad we're getting this interview, man. Top of the year, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I feel like this one's gonna go up, man. A lot of people been looking out for that guy, you know, so. Definitely, I've been, yeah. I've been laid back on the scene, but, you know, I really got a lot of shit on the way. Yeah. Shit show. Yeah, I was just about to ask you, do you have any projects out now, or where can they find I your music at right now? I got a project right now with Lil Jeremy at uh, State Arm. Shout out to Lil Jeremy. Yeah, shout out to East Side of East Texas. Yeah, yeah, for shit show. Yeah. That's my brother right there. Yeah. We locked in for shit show. I got a project with him, State Arm. Shout out to Four Pocket. You know, uh, it's about probably at like 50, 60K right now. I swear. Yeah, for sure. Oh, yeah, you going yeah, up. Yeah, I, yeah I mean, you know, I know, but for the people, you know what <laughs> yeah, I'm saying? Because I, I pay attention. Check that out, go check that out. Uh, and I got another project on uh, uh, YouTube. I got a project with Phrase. Two hits. I recorded that probably about like two years ago. I really had I recorded that. That was like my first song in the game. Recorded that. I, bullshit. I was bullshitting for probably about like a year and a half, two years. Really 
in the streets, in and out the streets, you know, money shit. And then I caught that bad motherfucker Jeremy. Then I just backed up, did something for this year, ended with my boy Stax, or uh, Do What You Do. Recorded that, uh, that's probably about like at 20K right now. And uh, been out probably like a couple of months, but shit. That's not Free bad, dog. Free yeah. my boy Stax, though, right now. My boy don't do that big, but yeah, for shit, sure. Yeah, how long you been rapping? I say, like, seriously. On a serious note? Yeah. I say probably about like a year and a half. Oh, that's not bad. You doing numbers like that? Like a year and a half. Yeah, man. Shout out to the age, man. I fuck with the age, man. Man, the city right now, <laughs> like, man. How, how the city going right now? So much shit going on, and so many people, like from the north to the south, east and the west, like especially the south side. I'm like, coming up from my my hood, my little third gen niggas. Them niggas for shit show. Little B Roy, Leak, Janky, Jack, man. All them little niggas. Them little niggas snapping, man. Them, Bang, poppy, shit, what else? Uh, we got Demo Trill out the mode, Al. Uh, it's too many niggas in the night, man. It's, it's, man, it's real, some, some talent out there in the city, man. For talent sure. out there in the city. For sure, that's real that you, uh, you know, showing love to the city. And most, most rappers, now artists, I ain't gonna say rappers, most artists nowadays don't do that. Everybody's for themselves, you know what I'm saying? Man, so. like I said, it's... Telling everyone. Yeah. So wait, you don't have a tape out, right? You just got a few singles. Yeah. Okay. So on that note, like, do you you got anything coming in the future? Can you get a, a projected date? You know what I'm saying? This is a Easy TV exclusive. Be, you know. Y'all be y'all be on the lookout for April, man. I'm dropping my mixtape in April. We'll be dropping. I will be having a music release party. You know, we're gonna go up in the city. You know, me and the gang, HMT, we'll be the we going down. Yeah, is that is so does April signify anything or is just some a date you pick? Just look out for April. Gotcha. Gotcha. Got okay. April. Yeah, I got you. I got you, I got you. Um is there anybody else you're currently working with? I know you said you've been with Le Jeremy and all uh, them, but uh I got a single with Al, Al on the way. Um uh, me and Walt, we for sure gonna get some shit in. A whole TSF family, I'm gonna fuck with them. Shit show. Shout out to South Walker, yeah, man. Shout out to Walk, shout out to Sons, you know, shout out to the whole TSF family, man, for shit show. Man, for sure, shout out to TSF. Um, what else, man? Let me see what else, what else I got going on. I, I got a whole lot of un, unreleased music, a whole lot of uh, Blue Money. We just got some shit recorded. Shout out to my boy Blue Money. He doing the cool little beat right now, too. Got, free him. Yeah, free my boys, man. Oh, let me see what else. I just got how a lot of old niggas music. I need to start dropping, man. Is it, is, is it? Can we get it? Is, is there a title for the tape yet? Or are you still working on it? Still working on it. For sure. But for sure, April. Y'all be on the lookout for April. April is dropping. For, for sure. sure. I make sure to uh, you know give a follow up on the Easy TV channel. You know, I want to see you win, my boy. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, sure, the sure, music man. is crazy. Y'all make sure y'all go check that out. Y'all yeah. nigga got a different sound. <clears throat> Um, next, uh, I know you kind of, kind of spoke, like, how the Houston rap scene is right now, you know, you said out all the youngest busy, like, would you like to elaborate more on that? Like, like, how, how do you feel personally about the Houston music scene? I, I'm loving it. Yeah, I'm shout out to Travis it. Scott, by the way. Yo, Travis Scott, too, the whole city, I mean, from how this shit was, about three years ago, four years ago, to how it is now, the city, I feel like my niggas come together, you know? Oh niggas on some rap shit, niggas putting down the gun, but shit still, you know, shit is what it is, but yo. Yeah. On the rap side, I'm, I'm definitely fucking with the city on it. You know, speaking about the guns, man, like me personally, you know, I'm 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 I ain't too much older than you, but I am older than you, you know what I'm saying? But like in my time, wasn't really no shooting, people got in the street, man. How you feel about these youngest wild around with these ratchets, man? Put down the guns, young man. Y'all ain't Y'all heard it here first. He young saying that. At times, hey. But then again, I understand niggas out there really thinking how, how she get out there. For she sure. nigga been in the situation. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, for sure. We ain't gonna speak on too much on that though. But you know. See, a nigga know why he told yeah. that toe. Shit. Yeah, you, do you, do you, you have. Signing up for it every time. Yeah. Just do like any time you're doing anything, nigga, you know, you're signing up for it. Yeah, for sure. It's just like that whole uh, no snitching movement. I feel like personally, if you're gonna live that life, you need to Why abide snitch? by the rules. You know what I'm saying? Like, Why snitch? yeah, don't do the time. Can't do. Don't do the crime. Can't do the time. Most definitely. Most definitely. Mm, for sure. 
Um, you, do you have <clears throat> back to the music? Do you have a favorite artist? Favorite artist. I couple favorite artists. Couple favorite artists. Old, new. Old and new. Old and new. Out. I fuck with uh, Pimp C for sure. Man, shout out to the Pimp Rest in Peace, man. Old. Uh, Don Key. It's uh, one of my personal favorites. Propane. Hmm. Shout out to Propane. Um, yeah. <laughs> them niggas for sure. Uh, fuck with that nigga Meek. Wayne for sure. I, I, I really fuck with uh, everything. Like, it's, it's niggas. Everybody got hits, everybody got, you know, different techniques, cadence, all this shit. I just, I know good music, and when I hear that shit, I fuck with it. No, for sure. Boosie, shit. Shout out to Boosie. You know, this go on and on. Yeah. I feel like um, any rapper who say that they literally came up with their own music off their off they own head, like they sound, they, influ they, they cadence, they all, I feel like they're a fucking liar. Because most definitely. Yeah, to make good music, bro, I feel like you, you gotta, had to have heard it. You gotta it. tap in, you gotta tap in yeah. with all resources. You you gotta you gotta have an ill sound yeah. for sure. Yeah. Piggybacking off that, like like were any of them or do you have any influences that got you doing what you're doing now? Shit. Let me say uh, for sure walk. Walk most definitely. Migos. Um so, uh, Which one your favorite Migo? Or do you have a favorite? Mm. I f me, I feel like take out the hardest, bro. That's just me. Take out hard, but I fuck with it. Mm. Take out Migo. Pure rap, take off got it for yeah, sure. For sure. For I, sure. I said it, I said it for sure, take yeah. off. Yeah, I ain't mean to interrupt you though, but on nah, the influence sure, like, question. Yeah, for sure. If that's it, just Migo sauce. Migo sauce. Uh, Kodak for sure. Hmm. Kodak, Kodak most definitely. Uh, that nigga German too. Yeah, for sure. I uh, I, I remember uh, when the German was first coming up. I was in school at the time, uh, right up the road uh, at Lamar, and the yeah. German was making noise up and down. I ten, you know what I'm saying? So that's one shit. Yeah. At that time, the nigga had got kicked out of. Uh, I was still in middle school at the time. The nigga got kicked out. That's when they. Uh, I had moved out to the Bay Town. Mm -hmm. That's when I first started them East Side niggas or them McNeil niggas and all them. That's when I was out there in Bay Town. Hey, oh, That's when I first started hearing that nigga. He, uh, I don't know what mixtape was, but then let's do it. That's not. That's my first song I was hearing from him. And ever since then, I was like, y'all fuck with bro, bro. Then we locked in one night. I was in the club. We was in the club at a cool little session. Germans come put it on. Linked in that night. Stay down and shit. That's my brother. Yeah, and if, if y'all haven't heard that, please be sure to go check that out. Check that out. So I'm gonna say hundred K and if it ain't hundred K, give them to hundred K. And then we're gonna get to a million. For sure. Yeah. <laughs> um uh by the way, um I just wanna say before I ask you the next question, I do got people in Dallas and I'm gonna you know definitely most definitely put oh, you in yeah. the door with them. You know, I feel like yeah. D, D town, you know, Houston D, you I know fuck with the D for sure. Yeah. 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 Um my next question is, uh, <clears throat> I know you're still up and coming and all that, but you you know, you're know kind of doing a lot better than a lot of people from Texas. You know how hard it is to blow in Texas. But do you have any advice for any up and coming artists? Keep grinding. Don't say yourself short. You know, you might record some other time, that's dirty, but shit, if you feel like it's, it's gonna slip, keep going. Don't, don't like Blueface. Don't let nobody tell you that you can't rap and you can't do shit, man. Like, you just gotta keep your head on your shoulders, keep pushing, keep going forward. That's the only way you don't conquer succeed in life. For sure. Yeah. I feel like, um, see, I only, you know, interview been only 13 minutes long so far, but I feel like uh, the little time we have spoke, I mean, since you seem a little older than 21 in the mindset, uh, you know, I fuck with that. You know what I'm saying? You ain't on no, you know, young nigga, see, you ain't crashing out. You, you, got, you got a goal and you trying to get to it. Um, so, what's a what's a success goal for you this year? Like, what's what's something you're trying to do in music? Because obviously it's music, you know what I'm saying. So, uh, dropping this mixtape, uh, doing some more collabs. More collabs. Yeah, with with, with uh, like other big artists. Really, the city ain't big artists. Mm -hmm. Cause I been, I really been trying to get some old shit on my end. Yeah. Situated, you know. And, but yeah, most definitely some old artists in the city. 
Especially my third gen niggas. We, we got a mixtape on the way. Got a mixtape on the way. Yeah, for sure. My, uh, my last question. I know I said it last while ago, but I actually just thought about it. Um, my last question. Is there any rappers or artists already that you already didn't link with? Not on no music stuff, just literally just brush shoulders with them and he, you know, they, they, they messing with the music, messing with the, with the character. I see no flaws at all, you know what I'm saying? So. Shit. Whole TSL family. I mean, everybody. Or Walt, 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 Few people. Over here, Scarface. Mm, legend. Um, whole lot of DJs throughout the city. I got this thing like V9, you know, Eden, Strip Clubs, or um, Cool Rappers, Beat On, Pesos, um, Jack Boys. Yeah. Hey, you uh, brush shoulders with peso peso yet? For sure, peso peso. Yeah, I feel like Brett Hart, hardest yeah. SA ever. Like I like how he bringing that culture back. Bro, free free sure, SPM. That nigga one of a kind. He got his own sign, just like I said. Shit. Hey, which Jack boy you speak of? This is one from the Houston or one from Florida? The one from Houston. Oh, one from Houston. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But shit, um, I guess we wrap the interview up right there. Um, shit, YB and Zaza, it's a pleasure. I appreciate yeah. you for stopping by the Easy Studios, man. We're making history today. Um, I, I hope a lot of people see this interview. Most definitely. This is how I'm going to do some more, man. Yeah, um, shit, you know, club way. Like. Yeah, where can they uh, follow you and find the music at? Mm -hmm. Follow me, YB and Zaza, YB underscore J-A-J-A-A, -A -A. you know. Is that Instagram, Twitter? Yes, is that... Instagram. I ain't got Twitter. Okay. I, I'm finna get a Twitter though. It's probably most likely on the white man does that too. Shit, oh. Um, let me see. Uh, SoundCloud, white man does YouTube, white man does You know, fuck with me. For sure. Until next time, man, I'm uh, definitely want you back in the studio, man, because I need some updates. Man, I'm going to probably try to catch up with you about like two or three months it. now. Mixtape on the way. Y'all be on the lookout for that. Dropping that April for sure. And I got some else cooking up, got a little EP with my third gen niggas, and I got some more shit throughout the city. Man, Al, I'm finna drop that single, man, Al, sickle. And shit, we finna turn it up to the team. Alright, until next time. <laughs> Peace. <laughs>